What's up guys, back again with another video. If you're new to the channel, my name is Skig and I make new videos every Friday. Now today, we're gonna take a look at how to set up credit card payments inside your open card store. So get ready for some free game, we're about to get it. guys so welcome back to another video in today's video I'm gonna show you guys how you can set up square in open cart so you can start accepting credit card payments now if you guys remember in the last video and I showed you how to do the install of the, the um, open cart application on your web server we, I went through towards the end and I actually completed an order so I added an item to cart went through checkout and we got to the payment section and the only payment option that was set up at that time was PayPal. So today we're gonna to set up a secondary payment option which is to accept credit card payments using the merchant company Square. So what we're gonna do here is hop back in over here and we're gonna to go to extensions, extensions, and then we're gonna go ahead and select payments from the drop down menu and then we're gonna scroll all the way down. It's in alphabetical order to where it says square and it says disabled. So we're gonna install it. And then we're gonna go ahead now and click edit. And obviously we wanna go ahead and enable it. And then once we get it enabled, we're gonna have to go over to the Square developer website to pull up some basic information and I'll show you guys that right now okay so once you have a merchant account with Square which is pretty easy to get all you really need you know you need a business name which you could register in your your city and you need to take that registration to the bank most banks will take a hundred dollar deposit and they'll open a business account with you and um, you can then use that information to apply for a merchant account with Square, which approval is pretty much like instantaneous. So once you have your Square merchant account, the web address that you're going to go to to set this up is developer.squareup.com forward slash apps. That's where you're going to go. So when you log in, you're going to click on this button here that says new application because you're creating a new app for this particular website. All right, so it says now, your new application will grant you full API access to your Square Merchant account. So we're gonna go ahead and create the application name here, which is Passive Income Merch. And then we're gonna go ahead, and it says here, the application name will appear in Square Dashboard to you and any merchants using your application. So we're gonna go ahead and click create application and then it's gonna say here application is created alright so once the application is created you're gonna be on the credentials page and it's gonna be in the sandbox settings we want to go ahead and click on this button here so we could turn it live or to production settings um, the application name is passive income merch the application ID you're gonna to need to copy this and you're gonna to need to paste this inside of open cart right here so you would paste that right here. The next thing you would also need is the OAuth authorization secret. So we're gonna copy and paste that as well from here. And you would get this information on this link right here. And you simply just copy the secret and paste it in right here. All right, the next thing is this link here, which is a redirect link. So when the person completes the purchase, it takes you back to your Webs takes them back to your website once they complete the purchase and you can't copy this in open cart so you have to manually go through and type it in and type out the full address in here once you're done you hit save and you go back to open cart and if we scroll up here to the top on this tab that says cron just make sure that this option is uh, check 
And uh, once you go ahead now and hit save, it's going to update the information. And if we go back to our checkout page here, we hit refresh and we go ahead and we click continue, continue, continue. It now provides us with two different payment options. So we have one option here for credit card, which we just installed. And then we have the previously installed option, which was PayPal. Now, once you have credit card selected, you go ahead and check the terms and conditions and you hit continue. It's going to load up the information here. And as we can see, the customer now has the option to enter the card number, the expiration date, the CVV, and the billing zip code for the card. And then they ha also have the option to check here to click save for future use. That's it, guys. That's pretty much how you set up Square on OpenCart. And this is the newest version. This video was done in 2020. So all the information here is relevant. All right, guys. So that's it for the video. That's pretty much how you set up Square on an open cart store. And I like Square because Square is, you know, it's very straightforward. It's easy. Um, they have like some really nice policies. I've had no issues with them. They are some really crappy merchant accounts out there. So, you know, just be careful. Um, what I like about Square, like I said, they have they have an easy to use interface. You can manually type your cards in. You could easily plug up their information to your website like I just showed you. That took two minutes. And um, they also have hardware devices. So, you know, if you're like a barber or somebody like me, like I'll go to a trade show, they'll have like a card reader that you could just plug into your phone and you could swipe and take orders while you're on the go. And whenever your batch is settled, the money is in your account the next business day. There's also an option to get it in instantaneously, but it charges you a little bit more. But, you know, I'm happy, man. So that's it for the video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you like the information presented here, go ahead and drop a like. And I'm about to go to the post office right now and ship off these orders. All right, so peace.